The white roads are those little tiny white roads that go to nowhere. Sometimes they dead end. All of that in between is really what it's all about. This trip is about riding the white roads. Jay is my longest term adventure partner. We met um, in high school. I was with Jay when I came up with the idea to create Cliff Bar. The year is 1990 and he says, I've been checking out this ride I want to do and it takes place out there in the valley where Dublin and Livermore are, heads out to the Central Valley, down the California Aqueduct, up Del Puerto Canyon, over to Mount Hamilton, right by San Jose, then down the hill into San Jose, over Calaveras Road, back into Pleasanton, and then back into Dublin. And we think it's gonna be about 125 miles. We know that there's gonna be areas where we're not gonna see stores and so to get food, so we pack um, six energy bars, 1990. At that point, this was the only energy bar on, on the market. So we start off right at first light because we know it's gonna be a long day. We hit about 125 miles by the top of Mount Hamilton. From there, we know it's down over Calaveras back to Dublin. It's gotta be another 50 miles home. It's three o'clock in the afternoon, gets dark at five, 50 miles to go. We're not feeling real strong. We're actually bonking, feeling really cold, really tired, really hungry. I've got to eat something. And I had eaten five of those energy bars by that time. And I pull out the last one and I look at it and I just put it right back in the pocket and said, I can't do this. I can't eat another one of these bars. I instantly had this, yeah, it was a vision of, I, I think I can make a better tasting energy bar. You know, people have ideas. You know, I've probably had a lot of other ideas in my life, but this one I'm very glad I followed up on. Good evening. How is everyone? Good. Awesome. I like the front row. Good. Um, my name is Ashley Keen. I'm the Midwest Marketing Manager for Luna, which is um, part of Cliff Bar. And I'm thrilled to be here and thrilled to be um, a sponsor. And what I love about this video and demonstrates kind of the Cliff Bar story and how we started um, is that it really started with an epiphany. Um, what I love about, you know, an epiphany or a moment or a spark, you know, you've all had that. You've had that moment where you're, you like have this feeling in your gut and your blood's boiling and you're either going to do something about it and act on it and take charge or you just leave it. And I think what's so great about the epiphany of Cliff Bar and how it relates to the epiphany tonight is we have 31 people backstage that had an epiphany whenever it was, and they decided to act on it. And they have spent the last three months uh, you know, facing their fears, really. And what, that's what I love that connection. Um, one thing, too, that I love that um, Luna Bar, Cliff Bar, that we can support mac and cheese and this fear experiment. When I met with Sai a couple months ago, you know, we're always looking, Cliff Bar, we're always looking to support local communities. Um, we are still a small family-owned company. Uh, we rather spend money on supporting local events, runs, um, you know, events like this versus money on a TV ad. Um, so when I met Saya and she told me about this life of yes and the sphere experiment and what people were doing, I was like, we, we have to be a part of this. This truly aligns with our mission and our values. So um, I'm, I'm thrilled to be here and support. And if you haven't tried Luna Bars, um, we'll be out there during in intermission as well. So that's it. I hope you enjoy the show. And yeah, have a good night.